In China, the coming of the Laba Festival signals that Spring Festival, or the Chinese Lunar New Year, is just around the corner. According to the Chinese lunar calendar, the eighth day of the 12th month is commonly known as Laba. The Laba Festival is a cherished traditional Chinese festival. On this day, it's customary for Chinese people to cook kanji using a variety of grains, beans and dried fruits, famously known as Laba kanji. The tradition of eating Laba kanji during the festival could be traced back to the Song Dynasty. Across the country, from north to south, everyone has their unique Laba kanji recipe. It comes in various flavors, including sweet, savory and spicy. As I'm here in Beijing, I'm making Beijing-style Laba kanji. This dish includes a variety of grains, such as rice, glutinous rice and sorghum, along with mung beans and red beans. It is complemented by a selection of colorful dried fruits, including lotus seeds, red dates and longan. Mmm, it's soft, sweet, yet glutinous and satisfyingly rich. In addition to Laba Kanji, there are many other food customs associated with the Laba Festival, such as Laba garlic, Laba noodles and Laba beans. This winter, why not try making a bowl of Laba Kanji yourself? <laughs>